Hi guys, um, so I've got Android 6.0 installed on my Galaxy S5 T-Mobile. Uh, if you have a Galaxy S5, the T-Mobile SM G900 T, or if you have the International uh, 900T F, sorry, let me go, G900 F, you'll be able to install this ROM. Also Canadian SMG 900 W8. You'll see that I've got full 6.0, alright? And um, if you have real Android Marshmallow, you'll be able to play this game. Uh, if you don't see this game with the Marshmallows, it's not real Marshmallow. Anyway, this ROM is really awesome. Actually, I would actually recommend as a daily driver. Uh, data works. I've got uh, 4G LTE up here. 4G LTE will be shown as 4G. All right, to get the data working, it actually took me a little bit. Uh, I'm not sure. In the beginning, I tried all these different APNs. It wasn't working. And I was actually picking up Peony at the school, and I was there, and then it suddenly it started working. So um, once it starts working, you'll be good to go. Just make sure you go to Access Point Names. Uh, set your APN to the correct APN for your carrier. For T-Mobile, that's fast-t-mobile.com. Alright, this ROM is actually nearly flawless. The only bug it has is that video camera doesn't work. Just don't use it, otherwise it'll cause problems and force close and whatnot. Uh, but still camera works and everything else works just fine. And I've tested Bluetooth, NFC, uh, everything works, which is ridiculously awesome. This is the only non-Nexus, like only non-AOSP device that has Android 6.0 Marshmallow working. Uh, nearly flawless, so I'm really surprised. And I've been daily driving this for about half a day. Uh, pretty good battery life. I haven't lost that much battery life. And of course, this does come with dough, so if you don't use your phone, uh, leave it on the desk, or when you go to sleep, it's not going to lose as much um, battery life. And also, there's this thing called uh, VR Toxin Mods. If you go to Animation Settings, you can go ahead and customize your animations. Um, your battery, you can go ahead and customize your hardware buttons. Ah, sorry, it's the way my f my camera's here, it's all a little bit weird. Uh, buttons, you can go ahead and customize your buttons. Alright, if you go into interface, there's a bunch of stuff, but none of these actually work. I think that's in development, so just ignore it until the next update. Notifications, uh, quick settings. You know, so it's a fully customizable ROM. I mean, there are bugs, but you can certainly daily drive it, turn your Galaxy S5 into a Nexus 6P, all right? So that is really cool. So definitely check it out uh, for this week's ROM of the week. If you have a Galaxy S5 that's supported, the T-Mobile, the G900F, the international model, um, or also if you have Canadian. So definitely check it out for this week's ROM of the week. And uh, do let me know what you think, but it runs near flawless, so check it out. And don't forget to donate to the developer of this ROM, a VR Toxin ROM. And uh, as always, I stay on Android.